Good morning. Welcome to the world of colors. I'm Colors. Today we're going to be making the Grinch wall hanging. Looks like this. This bow is not part of them. That's part of the garland. But this is what he looks like. And we're going to make him today. And I'll be right back in a moment to tell you what we're going to use for supplies. So what we're going to use, we need to get this wooden plaque from Dollar Tree. I've already signed it, but it, it comes as a plain plaque from Dollar Tree like that. We need one of those. We need some polyester fiber fill. We need a Santa hat from Dollar Tree. We're going to use a, about a foot of three-ply jute. You need a yellow marker. And then for the felt, so we're going to use uh, some different color felt. Well, I got one, two, three, four, five different color felts. So for, for the green, dark green, we're going to use a two by two inch piece and two one and a half by five inch pieces. And then for the white, you just want a white scrap piece for the eyes. And then a four by seven piece of the neon green and a one and a half by four inch piece of the neon green. And then the hot pink, you want a two by three and a half inch piece. And for the black felt, you just want a few scrap pieces for the eyes and nose and different things. So just gather up a few scrap pieces of the black felt. And then for the fur, you want to get the faux fur. It's 11 inches wide by 22 inches long. That's what it looks like. Now don't be worried about where are you going to find the fur. The fur is located on Amazon. If you go to Amazon and the first uh, couple vendors on the faux fur, put faux fur in there, and the first couple vendors you'll find a vendor it's called T A T U O. Um, you can go into that site, into that listing, and uh, order a 60 by 18 inch piece of the green fur for $15.99. And you can make three of this, the Grinch uh, wall hangings with that. So that's easy to do. It's a two day delivery. And I've got it in the description as well. So that's all we're going to need to make this today. So I'm going to move these around so where I can work. And I'll be right back with you. So the first thing we want to do is to take the green fur. It's 11 inches wide by 22 inches long. You could do the 20 inches long. I, I know that the, the piece of fur that you can get on Amazon is 60 inches long. So just make this uh, 20 inches long so you can get three of your Grinch wall hangings out of it. So that'd be fine. Um, so you wanna take your fur and fold it up like that. And just kind of take your hands and fluff up the fur. Sure those will meet together up there and then take the corners you can see what I'm going to do here and just we're just going to lay it up like that we're trying to round off the corners so we're going to do that on both sides just lay it up like that so we have a round bottom like that And then you want to take and put a little bit of the fur in the hat, the faux polyester fiber fill in the hat, like that. Fluff it up a little bit. And then we want to take the top of the green fur and just kind of put maybe an inch or so of it inside the hat. So you get your shape here. And 
like that. And then all you want to do is take your glue gun and go around and glue it every uh, place that you can to get this all glued together. So I'm just going to start right here and I'm going to come down and glue that. Keep that like that. And I'm going to just go all the way around and glue it. And I'm going to go glue underneath the hat on both sides to keep that glued down like that. And I'll be right back with you. So I've got it all glued. And the next thing we want to do is take the 4x7 piece of neon green felt. And you take that 4x7 piece and you want to cut this shape out from it. If you cut the shape out from it and you want to take that piece and we're going to put it down here on the bottom. We're just going to glue the sides all the way around to the bottom here. So we'll just glue it like that. Because this part's going to stay open. So we're going to put a little bit of polyester fiber fill in there. Just a little bit. And then we're going to take the other piece, this one and a half inch by four inch piece of the neon green. And we're going to put, we're going to cut this shape out of it. We're going to put that right underneath. You can see where I'm going here, right underneath here. And then I took this two inch by three and a half inch piece of hot pink. And I made this piece here. And we're going to glue that in there. There we go. And then the next piece will be the green, the dark green two inch by two inch piece for the nose. I'll leave that like that. I've got the nose over here. You just want to cut out a circle from that piece for the nose and glue that on there. Make sure I have it the same height on here. There we go. And then I cut these two little black pieces here out of the black scrap. 
They're kind of like little U, U's, the letter U. See how he's coming along. And then we want to put the eyes on. I'm making sure that the polyester fiber fill is tucked up enough that you can't see it. And you want to put the eyes on. And I have the eyes cut out here. I use the black and the white to do the eyes. And then I layered the black first and then the white and then the, and the black eyeball on there like that. So we'll glue those together. So I've got those glued together and I'll be right back with you. So the next thing I'm going to do is glue the eyes on. Sorry about my dogs barking. They must have seen something out the window. So I've got them kind of tilted in towards the nose. And then I cut the eyebrows from the one and a half inch by five inch pieces of green, dark green felt. So we have the two eyebrows. I'll be right back with you. So I've got the eyes glued on. The eyebrows are on there. You'll notice the eyes are white. I didn't put yellow eyes on here because I like the effect of coloring them in with the marker. It's kind of a subdued Okay, we'll be right back with you. So I'm on the back side of the Grinch now, and I've got the platter that I had you get at Dollar Tree, and I'm gonna glue this on the back to give it some structure. So we're just gonna put some glue on here.
bring it up over the top of the white trim of the hat and hold that down for a couple minutes. Be right back with you. Now I took my foot long jute and I tied it at the bottom like that, made a little loop here. And what we need to do is we need to make this to be our hanger so we can hang it at the right spot. So I'll put this behind here if I can, like that, and hold that down. I wanted, to, I wanted the hanger to come up here behind the hat. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna continue to hold this all down for a couple minutes and then we'll be finished. So I'm using the hairspray and I'm fluffing up the fur. All the way around like that. I even sprayed a little bit here to kind of firm up the felt that right there on the mouth. And then up here um, where the hat comes over, I put a little bit of glue right underneath right there to hold it like I want the hat. So give me a couple minutes to let this dry and I'll be right back with you. Okay, so we're finished now. He's all done. This is how you make him. It's just so quick and easy. If you like this video, make sure to like it. And if you want to see more videos like this, make sure to subscribe.